this? So close to town. Where are you leading me? More of you? I could beat you in my sleep. Most of these people died fighting. Someone didn't want them here. I've seen more graves here than I've met settlers. Many dead in more recent years. Everyone buried here died in 1677, a previous epidemic. Before I leave the cemetery, I need to understand what happened to Charles.
memory lingers here. I might be able to reveal it. What I picked up earlier should suffice. In each stain hides a story. In the name of the Lord, I command you. Be gone from this place! You do not command me, clergyman. Who are you, ghost? Unveil yourself! Well, since you ask so politely... Who are you? I am everything you've ever feared! Be gone! You have no shell, no ties, no purpose. No, but neither do you. <gasps> The tie that binds his ghost. With it, I can make him manifest. If I can find his grave. Now is a good time for we old friends to talk. We've come too far, Red and I, not to see you one last time. Your pupil has become the master. If we fight, I'll beat you. Come on, Charles. Join me now. I know you're here. I only wish to talk. Esther worries. Until... 
here at last. Oh, poor Esther. I'm so sorry, my friend. So sorry for us all. What happened? What's going on here? Sad to say, dear friend. I made a mistake. And it cost me my life. Is Red with you? There is no time to waste. Before you died, you investigated the curse. What did you learn? That our enemy is deceptive and merciless. That we should not underestimate its power. We? I am dead, dearest Dantea. But I am a banisher yet. I may still teach you. If I allow you, which I do not. Antea, do not repeat my mistakes. If a nightmare curses New Eden, you need all the help you can get. Its presence felt strongest in the meeting house. Perhaps the light of God there forced it to fight its ground. I had the building closed. The worst of the malevolence is contained. But it won't stay locked up for long. We'll banish it, Red and I. Our good friend's death shall not go unpunished. Be warned. This nightmare is too angry to be persuaded. And too powerful to be destroyed. Your death pains us greatly. Your return pains me too. I know. For my part, I'm glad to have seen you one last time. To have had the chance to warn you. I thought nightmares were a myth. A nightmare is the rarest of ghosts. A powerful, insidious spirit, birthed by tragedy most dreadful. How do I banish it? There is meager wisdom in the texts. What little there is says it cannot be banished at all. If it's a ghost, I can banish it. You took notes, I suppose? Where might I find them? They... Vanished. In the days before my death, perhaps I mislaid them. Which is not like me. If you find them, read them carefully. Perhaps I missed something. Something important. Why did you not wait for our help? The threat was rising. Despair growing. So many dead and dead. So much sickened flesh. So many afflicted souls. There was no more time. Do you know how this curse began? What prompted it, I do not know. Nor do I know when. Many months ago, certainly. But I do know this. This nightmare chose New Eden for a reason. So, a ghost. This one is different. Implacable. Very clever. Many magnitudes more ferocious than a spectre. And just as relentless. How did this nightmare kill you? I believed that I could come to the cemetery and make it manifest. To my initial delight, it worked. I now suspect it came by choice. It seemed amused. As if it were a pleasant game to weigh my measure as a man. How does its malevolence manifest? It poisons minds and sickens bodies. It draws spectres to it and sours the weather. It delivers nightmares to one's sleep. For a time, 
Screams tore through the night as folk awoke in terror. When it appeared to me, I did not see its true face. But I heard a woman. She was... love. I felt her gaze. My heart froze. I died. The spirit is vengeance pure. The ghost of one who was terribly wronged. I've heard your warning. You can go. No. I must remain. Esther needs my protection. My flock needs me too. You know how this works. You know I won't allow that. I am still myself, Antea. With time, I'll grow stronger. I can help you. The longer you haunt Esther, the hungrier you'll be. You know this. This is different. I'm the Reverend Charles Davenport, your friend and mentor. You know me. You know I am a good man. I knew you. You were a good man. Now you are a ghost, and I cannot let that stand. But I swear it, the nightmare will end, and Red and I shall do the ending. Charles Davenport was a good man, and a fine mentor. And you a fine student, though you took a hard line. I never could unpick that from your character. Has life tempered you since? Life has tempered my steel. Death and the manner of it has made you the very thing you once opposed. Goodbye, Charles. Peace on your soul. Remembrance on your soul. Wait. wait. Wait for what? We're banishers. Death to the dead. Let Esther choose herself. Oh Lord, please don't ask me to do that. Esther, my good wife, and the very best. I miss you so. Oh dear Lord, Charles, why are you here? Why have you come back? You must leave, please. I must stay. I must protect you. The thing in the meeting house feeds on our torment. I should have known better. I know better now. Antia, give Charlie the ascent he deserves. Charles Davenport, you have no reason to stay. Go. Let Esther grieve in peace. Save her, my friends. And save yourselves. Save them all. I'll walk Esther home. I'll do it. The women can talk. Uh, then, all the way to the schoolhouse and make the bed. Charles is at rest now. And Tia, she gave him the care he needed. My child, where do you think he is now? He's... Uh, I don't know. I miss the warmth of his hands. His calm presence in our house. If I close my eyes, I can picture him. He's in a place where sunlight chases the snow away. It is warm and there is fresh milk. The sheets are cleaned and pressed and folded. Nothing can ever be the matter. You're right. He's at peace. And you deserve to rest.
I'm sorry. I'll miss him. Dearly, tomorrow we'll continue investigating the curse. Good night, Esther. I am glad you are here. Both of you. We need you. You should get some sleep. You'll need it. We did the right thing. Charles was our friend. I love you, Red McCraith. But? But when it comes to ghosts, your heart makes you reckless. It's dangerous. Were you really about to banish Charles? Charles would have done the same for your ghost or mine. I hope he'd have at least hesitated. Charles was a good man, full of love. Banishing his ghost wouldn't have been easy, but it would have been right. Ghosts only bring misery, Red. Make no mistake, they steal life's essence from the living. Aye. They don't always do it out of malice. Of the man. We are banishers. We end suffering for those who live. We bring closure to those who don't. A ghost may suffer too. A sin puts a gentler end to it. But not a safer one. Better to banish and be sure. Would you banish me? 
Fikinta. You'll not escape me so easy. You I would bring back from the dead. <laughs> That's not funny. I'd fill you with fresh essence. I'd give you so much essence you'd return bloated with life. Steal essence from the living to feed my ghost. <laughs> you with me? You're a scruffy-headed lout, Red McGrath, and I will never let you go. Over my dead body, mister. I thought I was meant to be the soft-hearted one. <laughs> you are. I think Charles was right. This thing in the meeting house could be, a, what do they call it, a nightmare? I really hope not. Such entities are legendary ghosts, even for banishers. We'll see tomorrow. Now, to sleep. This was a dreadful day. Poor Charles. Poor Esther. And Taya, she took her firebane. She says I'm the reckless one. Where are you? You're hardly in the meeting now, sorry. Who's there? And there? Why would you go up there alone? I'm hoping. And there? You spectres have seen Antea, have you? Ah! You're the boss of all that could have included me. Yeah. Blind. All blind. 
Oh, Red, can't you see? We never stood a chance. Antea, you hot? Where are you? I'm here, my love. What happened? <laughs> I'm here, my love. How mundane. Show yourself. God came to the man in a dream and said, Behold, thou art dead but the man had done nothing wrong and said lord wilt thou also slay the righteous what will you slay the righteous not alarmed. I bring you aid. There is no aid. There is only dereliction. Where's Antea? What have you done with her? That was Paul's. Lady, if you hurt her... You cling to love, a fool to the last. There is no love. There is only defilement. No. <laughs> <laughs> Cut him 
vanishes, you too will be consumed! We only wish this... Three blind mice, three... Three blind mice, see how they run. You will suffer like I do! We are not your enemy! Three blind mice, three blind, three blind mice. You too will be consumed. You want to help? If you laid a finger on her... You know what? Come to her aid? Oh, there is no aid. There is oh, only... Oh, oh, retribution. Give him back. Oh. How touching. You come to claim your man. You think you love him. You do not. There, in the dark oh. of your manner, there is no love. Only betrayal. I offer you a trade. He stays and you leave with your life. I'll bargain with no ghost. You have a brain, yet you think with your idiot heart. You're weak. to her aid now when all is lost. If you do, I'll be waiting. The icy ocean made a diamond from his grief, then buried it in his heart. The weight of his failure dragged him down.
Outside time, drowning in the gloom, he spoke her name. Take me instead, he screamed, soundless, to the cold and silent waters. Out beyond the black veil of death, something heard his cries and reached for him. Let her go. Take me instead. Let her go! Ah, you're awake. Who are you? She who rescued you. Tended you for days on end. Weeks, maybe. Weeks? Oh, God. What have I done? Get your strength back before you beat yourself up. She's dead. Yes. That's why you're here. And why I was sent to look after you. Who are you? I feel like we've met, but... I'm sure we have not. I feel like I know you forever. But do I? You're confused. It's normal. You've been near killed by a nightmare, you've lost your beloved, and now you've a witch by your sickbed. Witch? Witch. I go by Seeker. Find the Banisher, said my mistress. Tend him, and then answer any questions he asks you before you leave him be. So, how do you feel? Does it matter? Of course it matters. It means you're alive, and you haven't given up. Who sent you? Her name is Ceridian, and my hands and words are hers. Beyond that, don't burden yourself. Ceridian, this little seeker who asked you to find me, is she Scots or something? It's Ceridian. She's too old to be from anywhere in particular, and while, yes, I found you, she told me where to look. This nightmare, how it spoke, how it tore right through her. I've never seen the like of it. Few have. Fewer have lived to tell of it. What drew such a powerful spirit here? Who knows? Something awful, I don't doubt. The worst angers rise from the most terrible wrongs. The friend said that. He's trying to warn us. An immutable law. You have wise friends. to do now? How do I... How do I do it alone? You're not alone. Have faith. If Ceridian had told me more, I'd tell you it. But you must have faith. <laughs> have faith. You say that you do not know me. Easy said. Harder done. 
What comes easy in life tends not to matter. It's the hard stuff that counts. You've a hole in you. A yawning, grimacing pit in your soul. That's love, that is. The hole won't fill because the love won't die. God, what have I done? Here's the thing. Unlike most, you get a second chance. I suggest you seize it. Why do you hate me? I serve my mistress. She bids me help you, so I help you. Ceridian says the wall between the living and the dead is under threat. You, it seems, have a part to play. This is mine. You've lost me. No, I found you. But so did your grief. And it demands to be felt. You may think you're done with your ghosts, Red McCraith. But they aren't done with you. I'll go now. Rest. Why ever my mistress saved you, she has good reasons. The best. Where are you going? Home. To Ceridian. She needs me. Where shall I find you if... or when I need to? Maya marshes. Great big swamps other side of the woods. You can't miss them. We'll know when you're coming. Until we... meet again then. That's right, Banisher. Now, turn around. What? I'm leaving. I don't know what this is, but I'm staying away from it. Where am I?
damn it. What am I doing here? Now is not the time. Leave me up. Come on, you mongrels. Am I the last bloody living soul here? 